welcome to my channel or welcome back. I'm Yosha and I'm your go-to girl for all things real. Today I'm coming with a torrid shoe haul and I'm so excited because I tried a new size. So in my last few hauls that I did, I was ordering size 10 or 10 and a half. I've learned that torrid runs a little bit big so I decided to try nine and a half for some of my shoes today. I will be showing y'all four pairs of shoes. They had a huge sale last month and everything was 30% off. So this order was under $150. I have a bone to pick with Tori though, because lately they've been saying that the cute shoes cannot be combined with any promotions. So my advice is to be sure to sign up as a Torrid Rewards member so you can use Torrid Cash. Luckily I was able to get 30% off on everything, but I'm not gonna hold y'all. I'm not spending $80 or $60 on a pair of Torrid shoes. I just, it just doesn't sit right in my spirit because I've been able to catch deals where things were 50% off, 40% off, 30% off. I gotta get a discount. Like when it comes to their sandals, for example, I'm not paying $30 for a flip flop or a sandal. That's just me or a slide. Like I'm just not gonna do it. I have not worn anything yet. I need to open this stuff so that if it don't fit, I can return it. And I wanted to do it on camera. So I'm finally here doing this and I'm really excited. I'm going to show y'all the first pair that y'all, I have been eyeballing this on a website for quite some time, but was waiting on a, a discount and my size to be in stock. Now, I was gonna size up in this shoe because of the style of the shoe, but I was like, you know what, let me just go for it because they actually didn't have a 10 for one. And the second thing is, y'all gonna see when I show you the style of shoe. First of all, kudos to Torrid for taking heed to what's trending and branching out of the alternative style. Don't get me wrong, I like platforms, I like wedges, but I want some of the little trendy shoes that you see on Shein and Rainbow and Lovely Wholesale too. So when I saw the clear um, translucent style with the brown heel, they had it a nine and a half, I said okay. Let us hope that this is one of them times where Tori continues to size big, cause if not, I'm gonna have to return these. But I'm really hoping that they fit. I have been wanting a shoe with a clear heel. I'm gonna just be real, they don't make these type of shoes for us with wide feet. If you didn't know, I have a wide ass foot, no arch, no no support on my foot, none of that. So I was so excited to see the shoe. Do y'all see this? It has a clear heel and it has clear in the strap. I am so hoping that these shoes fit. So hoping that they fit. And by the looks of it, it should fit because it has that slant for wide feet. But again, this is my first time trying a nine and a half. I usually go with a 10 and they didn't have no 10. So I don't even know if this shoe is gonna be available on the website, but I will overlay a picture of what it looks like. The reviews were great. A lot of the women were really happy with the shoe. I wanna be one of them happy women. <laughs> I'm going to try it on for y'all. And then I'm gonna overlay some clips from my phone cause I'm shooting on my camera today. This is definitely a cute shoe for fall. I think that this, this nudish brownish color, it's like a khaki brown, is perfect for fall. You could probably get away with this in other seasons too, but I definitely think it's a cute transitional shoe. Get into the buckle, that's cute. I like we'll it. We'll be back after these commercials. mystery is solved after four orders with them I found my true size my torrid size is a nine and a half so going forward I think I'll be ordering my shoes in a nine and a half because these fit like a glove I love these shoes I cannot wait to wear them so super excited to keep these shoes and to know that I probably should continue to order nine and a half when it comes to torrid and just keep in mind, they sell extra wide with shoes. So it's not like getting a narrow shoe from any other place. So don't be afraid to experiment with sizing down 
sometimes even ordering two of the same shoes so you can try both sizes because if it's a cute shoe like the one I just took off it may not be there if you wait until you get your order to reorder later so moving on I'm gonna try on the next heel these were final sale and I ordered them in a 10 I know I know probably shouldn't have done that but 10 typically fit me too so I'm gonna go ahead and try on that pair next and i'm going to show it to you first like i did with the first piece. these are four cream jelly crisscross heels they're in a 10 they didn't have a nine and a half before y'all yell at me but when i saw the style of them i was like they might end up being a shoe that i need to have stretchy anyway because of the crisscross looking at these on site i'm like these look big as hell i'm, I'm like okay um i probably should have left these where they were at I was thinking that they would be really cute to wear in the summertime. Um, they're very, very thick. Like it, like it's giving no place like home. Like I love that they're all white because that means I can wear them for the rest of the summer. I'm gonna just slap my feet in them and, and let's see. I hope they fit because I can't return them. Okay, so they, they do fit and I'm just doing the squeeze, this motion like this with my feet. I'm doing like this to squeeze them in. They aight, y'all. I don't know, I'm, I'm gonna figure it out. I'm gonna find something to do with them. These last two pair are sandals. I got these in a nine and a half wide width they are this oh what color is this y'all this is let's see the tag is still on them it says 4s mauve pu braided flip-flop so it's mauve but you know it almost looks like a lavender off on on camera it, it's giving mauve i guess but in person it almost looks like a light lavender I'm so glad I didn't size up. I can tell that they're very big just by looking at them. But I thought that these were very cute sandals to transition from summer to fall in. I'm gonna go ahead and slide my foot in them. I don't know why they keep going for this big shape, but this very big square-like shape, it makes your feet look big as hell. So, Torrid, y'all can tone that down a little bit. We don't want it to look too, you know, I don't know, too big. As far as the sizing, honestly, I have a little bit of room in the back. I could probably return these. I could probably return these. They I, right, you know. They kind of remind me of, of what I've been seeing on trend that you can get from like wholesale stores and even Shein and Lovely Wholesale. Rainbow be having these bright colors. They kind of look like that. This is the last pair here. And they're just a T-strap sandal. Nothing fancy. I have these shoes already in green and I ordered them in a 10 and they were kind of big to me. So I went down this time around because I thought that it would fit better at a nine and a half. And I'm trying it on right now. And I was right, the nine and a half fits good. y'all to see during prime day all these companies that you normally shop at put their stuff on sale too because they want to compete with amazon everybody is competing with amazon because they are the fastest shipper out there they sell everything amazon is giving everybody a run for their money so when amazon has prime day and they put all these products on sale the other businesses don't want to lose their money too so they put stuff on sale as well to try to get their fans to spend money with them i like this tote pair of sandals i honestly think i'm gonna return the braided flip-flops because i don't like them on me like i'm you know i'll show you know i showed y'all the the tote sandals they actually fit a little bit better as far as the length but the funny thing is is that the strap of the of the shoe is kind of tight on my foot making it more uncomfortable 
than the previous pair. So it kind of makes me want to return those too. I don't know. Overall, I'm super impressed toward just from the first pair alone. I don't really love the other three pairs as much as I love the first but pair. But I'd love to hear from you. Y'all tell me which shoes you'd keep out of these four. What do you think is best? What were your favorite? If you want to see more Torrid videos from me, keep it in mind that I don't really shop for their clothes very often. I love their shoes because I have a flat wide foot. And if you have a flat wide foot and you can't find good shoes anywhere else, Torrid seems to understand how to cater to us with wide feet, flat feet, and no arch. Be sure to subscribe, comment, let me know what you feel about this video, the shoes, what stores I should try next. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye.